Mukazi tu mahali ulikuwa kwa urudi. Kagusi wa mitambo. Ya, vile mnaeleke. Kojo. Kojo. Your Excellency, we want to thank you. This is one of our universities among the 36. And Your Excellency, this university was given the charter last year, 2022. It's actually among the youngest. And I want to assure you, Your Excellency, that if there's one university that has done so well, in this particular university because the amount that the government has been able to give them ever since seven years ago is 850 million for infrastructure development and your excellency they have been able to use that money very well we have also been able to give them one billion for the current which has also been used very well and it's the only university your excellency that does not have a pending bill. Last year... Kwa sababu ya kutambua umuhimu wa elimu, mwaka huu, in the last eight months, tumeajiri wa alimu wapia Kenya elfu wa msini na sita. New teachers to assist our learners and our children in school. Na vile vile, tumepangia hawa maneno yao. Nimeweka pesa karibu bilion imoja ya promotion ya teachers. Teachers have not been promoted for the last 12 years, almost 13 years. Mwaka huu tumeweka pesa ya promotion ya walimu hawa. Pia tumeongezea hawa maneno kidogo kidogo wakae chonjo. Sasa nyinyi nauliza walimu wa Kenya wa malizane na Teacher Service Commission. I have already told the Teacher Service Commission wa sign CBA na walimu ndio tuendelee bila ya matatizo hatutaki kusumbuana sisi tumekubaliana hawa walimu hawakuniuliza ati tuwaongezee mshahara mimi niliamua mwenyewe hawakufanya maandamano si ndio hawakufanya maandamano tukaongeza walimu 1056 so tunataka tuwe ni inchi yenye utaratibu ni inchi yenye heshima na amani hatutaki kuharibu inchi yetu so that is the place we want to work together as we work towards one united nation. Nita tumana hapa wizara yetu ya housing to wajenge hostels elfumbili. Ya wanafunzi facilities ya hostels. And I want that project to start before the end of this year so that we can complete it in the next one year. So, tatafuta kama shilingi billion mbili ya mambo ya hostels ya university ya Alupe. Ndiyo tuwakikisha kwa mba tunasukuma hiyo manena mbele. Tumakubaliana? Tunaelewana na mna hiyo? So, hiyo ndiyo mambo ya maendeleo ya hapa ambayo ningependa kusema kwa sababu sisi tunastambua kama serikali umuhimu wa elimu katika taifaletu la Kenya. Ndiyo sababu katika budget ya mwaka huu, tumeweka pesa shilingi bilioni miasita thelathini ya kusomesha watoto wetu kutoka primary school mpaka university. Na kwa sababu elimu ni ya muhimu, that is why we want to equip every young person in Kenya. Every child in Kenya must not be left behind. Na ndiyo sababu vile vile tumebadilisha mfumo ya masomo katika university. Ile pahali tulikuwa tunatoa capitation to the university. Now we are changing. We are going to give, be giving scholarship to every student. Na tumeongeza pesa ambayo itakuja katika university. We were underfunding our universities by almost 50%. So this year, again, we've made a policy decision that we are now going to be funding universities 
from a budget of 44 billion, we have now increased to 82 billion that will go to our universities so that all our children in our universities can have adequate resources and lecturers can be paid and all other bills can be paid so that the quality of education in our universities can improve. Tumekubaliana ya kwamba we need to have a plan na ndio tumeweka katika mpango yetu ya vile wanafunzi wakitoka shule, wengine wakitoka college, wengine wakitoka university pia tuko na mpango ya ajira kwa wanafunzi wetu. Nimeeleza watu wa Busia vile tumepanga mambo ya ajira, ya affordable housing, ya county aggregation industrial park, ya special economic zone, ya digital jobs na hiyo ecosystem yote ya value addition, agro processing and also manufacturing. That whole space is because apart from making sure that we have a plan on the education of the children of Kenya, we must also have a plan on how to expand opportunities for the young people of Kenya to get jobs, to get employment, to uh, engage in enterprise, and to meaningfully contribute to the building of the economy of Kenya.